Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you are doing well. Today is still going to be a lash with me. I have my handy dandy mannequin out just so that I could show you guys the mapping and how to draw out your maps for your clients. Um, and then after I'm done drawing out the map, I will then go ahead and switch over and you'll go ahead and see my client and me actually working on her. But yeah, so for now, we're just going to be going over the mapping. I have my uh, multi-layered mannequin right here and these are just some regular iPads. Um, and today's mapping we're actually going to be doing in open eye. So for my client, she wants a light volume set and it's going to be an open eye. So I'm going to be starting off with my longest length. So my longest length on this set is going to be around two thirds of the way in. So around right there. That is my point. And from there, we're going to be going down on the outer corner and also more down towards the inner corner. So I'm going to be doing about three different sections right here. And then continuing on. And doing about even sections all around so now that i have all my placements made then i go ahead and choose out what links i'm going to be using so for this set i'm not going to be putting any spikes this is strictly going to be all fans so i don't have to worry about any significant points i'm just going to be looking for my baseline fans so starting off in the inner corner i always like to go in very short on the inner corner so if I'm doing like a volume set, I'll start off with the 8 or a 9. If I'm doing a light volume set, I'll start off with the 7. I personally just love short inner corners. And then it just, I feel like it adds so much more definition. But yeah, so starting off, we're going to be going in with 7. And then 8, 9, 10, 11. 12 and then our peak is going to be 13 we're going to be dropping back down 12 13 10 and some nines on the very outer corner you could just leave this as 10 but of course for me i love me some good definition i love mixing a bunch of links together well not together but i love incorporating a bunch of links it just it makes it feel more I guess personalized more customized you know really fits their eye shape um but if i wanted to i could definitely just use a 10. using a 9 on the very outer corner is going to make the biggest difference but in some situations it will make the biggest difference so just for that i always go the extra mile now for my clients' lashes, I'm going to be using a, you don't have to write, this is just so that you have some more information about my clients' lashes in the next clip. Um, we've already done the mapping and this is the most that you would probably do on your iPad when it comes to mapping. For extra, um, with this client, I'm going to be using a 0 0.7 diameter with my fans and I'll also mix in some 0 0.5 diameters into my fans. And for the volume of my fans, the actual how many is in between each fan, I would say I'll be alternating in between 3D and 6D. So I'll be using 3D, 4D, 5D, 6D really depends on my clients' lashes. For some people, they'll have like a cluster of little lashes that are really close together and then the little section next to it the lashes may be a little bit more separated so that's why i say i alternate in between three to six because once you start doing lashes you'll be able to identify how much you may need in that area just so that it can look a little bit more cohesive so that it can look a little bit more full because i can just imagine if i were to use 3d all across the if i were to use 3d all across the eyes right but then you have this one little cluster where the lashes are so piped, packed together when you apply those 3d when she opens up her eyes you'll be able to notice that this eye area is more packed than the rest of the eye so that's why it is important for you to gauge 
what you actually need for your claim. But yeah, you guys, that is it for the mapping. Now, I hope you enjoy the rest of this video. The rest of this video is just going to be a simple lash with me, no talking, since I am already explaining everything in the front now. But yeah, thank you guys, and I hope you enjoy today's video. I'll see you on the next one. Walk away, yeah, we could just stay away The things I love about you, I can't change No, 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 no
bring me to so many tears after all these years. See my days are cold without you. My